Welcome to the support videos for workflow automation. This video will demonstrate how to change the EM user and DBO password in Control M Enterprise Manager. There are two main admin passwords in Control M Enterprise Manager. The EM admin password stored in Control M authorizations. This is the admin user used to log in to the Workflow Automation Client and Configuration Manager. And the database owner DBO password. This one is used by all the Enterprise Manager processes to access the database. To change the Control M Enterprise Manager admin password, we need to open a session on the Control M Configuration Manager. Go to the Security tab. Click on the Authorizations button and choose the user that we want to change the password. In this case, I'm going to select the EM user. Open the user properties and set the new password. We click OK to save our changes. And it is very important to note that we need to make sure that all the users with this username have to exit the GUI. When the last user with this username has logged out, the change will be applied and then the new password is going to be read from the, from the database. To change the database owner password, if we are using the high availability of Control M, we need to disable the automatic failover mode. To do this, please check the knowledge article that is included in the description of this video. Next, stop all the EM components and do a right click to set the desired state to down. It is very important to wait until they are down. Now we can ask our DBA to change the DBO password in the database. For this example, I'm using a Microsoft SQL database. Below in the video description, you can find the link to the knowledge article where we describe the steps to change the password on the different databases that we support. So I proceed to change my password. The next step is to recycle the EM naming service and the configuration server. So I will start with the configuration server. Do right click desired state recycle. And continue with the naming service. We store the encrypt password in the mcs.ini file in the EM server. From this file, the EM processes retrieve the password to connect with the database. In order to update this file, first make a backup of the file. Now we run the CryptoCle utility to update the password in the file. As you can see, the syntax is the next. The user ID, the new password, and the path to the mcs.ini file. To validate the change, we check that the file has been modified with the time when we run the utility. And finally, we proceed to recycle the Control M Enterprise Manager configuration agent according to our operative system. In this case, I'm running on Windows, so I will recycle it from the Windows services. For Enterprise Managers running on Unix or Linux platform, please do it via the root underscore menu. Now we can proceed to restart all the EM components. As we can see, all the components have started using the new DBO password. That concludes this Control M Solutions video. Please see our Knowledge Base and YouTube channel for more videos like this. Thank you.